South Africa has good gun control legislation and firearm homicides are declining, accounting for a third of all homicides. But according to the UN, South Africans are still the fifth highest trigger-happy nation on earth. Professor Sebastian van Ass of the Red Cross Children's Hospital says its trauma unit sees far too many children with gunshot wounds. He explained why the age requirement for a gun license needs to be increased. The frontal lobe of the brain, uh, it's uh, the part of the brain which is involved in decision making and also calculating the future consequences of whatever you do. And that part of the brain only matures at the age of 25. Dr. Lane Benjamin, a psychologist working with Cape Flats communities, says what is on the rise is the intensity of violence. She says exposure to this could create a breeding ground for killers. By the time that this kind of child has a gun in his hand, we're having this discussion a little too late. When violence is a lifetime experience, it results in the brain almost becoming incubated in terror and quite threat-orientated and aggressive. So the child's brain becomes wired for threat. While all agree violence is out of control, some feel the anger is misdirected. Illegal weapons, a key issue. Firearms by themselves are not the problem. It is merely an issue in this regard. And I believe that government and the various instruments of government need to look at the real problem rather than merely the symptoms in this regard. Abra Barbia, SABC News, Parliament.